There's a bear in there And a chair as well There are people with games And stories to tell Open wide Come inside It's play school And the toes And the little toe Hello, I'm Jeremy. <laughs> Tickles. Hello. I'm drawing round Benita's foot. Yeah. And there we have it. Benita's foot. Now, let's cut it out. Sorry, in. Cut, 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 cut. Round one toe. The next toe. Three toes. Four toes. Big toe. Cut, 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 cut. And then round the heel and come out there. A yellow foot shape. And a purple hand shape and a pink hand shape and a blue hand shape. Cut them out earlier. Lots of coloured hands and a yellow coloured foot. I'm going to turn this into something that has an eye, a big round eye, and a big smiley mouth. And this also has fins, and these are the fins. It's a fish, a purple hand fish. Swimming with a blue hand fish. Hello. <laughs> These fish look a bit a bit bare, don't they? Hmm. I think I'll decorate them. Let's decorate them. All right. Um, with green. Yes. Okay. Purple. Purple. You ready? Mm hmm Okay, here we go. Put a spot over here. And a stripe over there. And a spot over here. And a stripe over there. And a lot of little squiggles, squiggles over here. Everywhere. It's a spotty, squiggly, stripey kind. Oh, blue hand fish. <laughs> you know, you know that song, don't you? Sing All it right. with us. Yes, and I'll decorate some more of these fish with spots. Put a spot over here, and a spot over there. Put a spot on your ear, and a spot on your hair. And a lot of little spots in the air, everywhere. It's a spotty kind of day. All right, a spotty purple handfish. And now, a pink handfish. All right, with squiggles. Let me see what colour. I'll have that one. Put a squiggle over here and a squiggle over there. Put a squiggle on your ear and a squiggle on your hair. And a lot of little squiggles in the air everywhere. It's a squiggly kind of day. There are pink squiggly handfish. And last one, a yellow foot fish. With stripes. Put a stripe over here and a stripe over there and a stripe on your ear and a stripe on your hair and a lot of little stripes in the air everywhere. It's a stripey kind of day. And a stripey yellow footfish. Footfish. Mm -hmm. Yes. All the hands and footfish coloured in now. Mm -hmm. Now we need some water to put them in. They like to swim in water. Mm -hmm. This cardboard can be the water with holes for the fish to go in. All right. So, need to stick them on some paddle pop sticks. Got right. some blue tack. Stick it on like that. And there's a pink squiggly handfish. Pink squiggly handfish. Swim, swim and splash into the water. And a blue, spotty, strappy, squiggly handfish. Blue, spotty, squiggly, strappy handfish in there. And 
a purple spotty. Swim, 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 splash. And a yellow stripy footfish. 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 In here. Okay. There. Very good. All different squiggly spotty fish swimming in the water. Swim, little fish, swim, little fish, swim, swim, swim. Swim, little fish, swim, little fish, swim, swim, swim. There. There's another shape. And this is going to be, I'll just finish this off here, like that. And this has an eye and a mouth. It a, has a long slippy body with a shell on top. It's a snail, a water snail, a slow green water snail that lives in the water with the fish. And I'll just stick on some blue tack. And you can go across to the water. Oops. There. With all the spotty, squiggly, stripy fish. This is Bit and Bot. Remember them? They're the play school fish. Can you see their fins? Long fin on top and little fin on the side. Fins help them to swim. And they steer with their long tails. See their eyes? And their mouths? Opening and closing, open, close, open, close. They're called goldfish because they're a golden orange colour. See the tank? That's their home. It's got everything that fish need. It's got pebbles, like the bottom of a river, and weed for swimming in and sometimes to hide in. And here's something to share the tank with the fish. And to keep it clean, they're water snails. Can you see their shells? That, that's a bit like a home to keep their soft body all protected from the fish. Can you make your hands like a fish? Wiggle them like a fish swimming. Come on. Swim, little fish, in water clear. Fly, little bird, up in the air. Creep, little caterpillar, creep. Sleep, little children, softly sleep. Come on, you too. Fish. Swim, little fish, in water clear. Fly, little bird, up in the air. Creep, little caterpillar, creep. Sleep, little children, softly sleep. And there's someone asleep in this house. And there's the cat sitting on the windowsill. What day is it, do you think? Behind the gate, we'll find out. Today is Wednesday. Now let's see who's in the house. Aha, it's an old man and an old woman. He's reading the newspaper and she's the one having an afternoon nap. All right. Let's let them have their nap. All quiet in this house. Every day, we're singing a song about a house. A house with a wall. Ready to build it up? Come on. Here's 
Here's a house with a wall, with a wall, with a wall. Here's a house with a floor, with a floor, with a floor. Here's a house with a roof, with a roof, with a roof. Here's a house falling down, crash! There's no house anymore, anymore. There's no house anymore. Well, there's something looking for a house in the story. But before the story, let's see what time it is on the flower clock. The long hand is pointing straight up, so it's something o'clock. And the short hand is pointing to the two, so it's two o'clock on the play school clock. Underneath the clock, a bird's nest, an old shoe, and a letterbox. The story today is The Best Nest. And here's the first picture. Mr. Bird was happy. He was so happy he had to sing. This was Mr. Bird's song. I love my house, I love my nest. In all the world, my nest is best. Then Mrs. Bird came out of the house. It's not the best nest, she said. I'm tired of this old place, said Mrs. Bird. I hate it. Let's look for a new place right now. So they left the old place to look for a new one. Well, this place looks nice, said Mr. Bird. Let's move in here. Oh, but somebody else had already moved in. <laughs> so they looked at another house. This one looks nice, said Mr. Bird, and there's nobody in it. <gasps> You're wrong, said Mrs. Bird. This house belongs to a foot. So they went on looking. I like this one, said Mr. Bird. It has a pretty red flag on the roof. Whoops. Oh, but it was not all right. I guess I made a mistake, said Mr. Bird. You make too many mistakes, said Mrs. Bird. I'm going to pick the next house. And here it is, right here. I like this big place, said Mrs. Bird. This is the place to build our new nest. They went right to work. They needed many things to build their nest. First, they got some hay. They got some stocking wool. And mattress stuffing. They got some horse hair. They got some man hair. Ouch! It took them the rest of the morning to build their nest after they'd taken everything back. This nest is really the best, said Mrs. Bird. I want to stay here forever. Mr. Bird was very happy too. He flew to the top of his house. He sang his song again. I love our house. I love our nest. In all the world, our nest is best. He was so busy singing, he didn't even see Mr. Parker coming. Every day at 12 o'clock, Mr. Parker came to the church. Mr. Parker came to pull a rope. The rope went up to the bird's new nest. 
the rope rang the big bell right under Mrs. Bird's nest. Bong, bong, bong. Mrs. Bird got out of there as fast as she could fly. When Mr. Bird came in, all he could see was a mess of hay and wool and horsehair. Where was Mrs. Bird? I will look for her until I find her, said Mr. Bird. He looked everywhere for Mrs. Bird. He looked down into a chimney, but Mrs. Bird wasn't there. Then he saw a big fat cat. There was a big fat smile on the fat cat's face. There were some pretty brown feathers near the fat cat's mouth. Mr. Bird began to cry. Oh dear, he cried. This big fat cat has eaten Mrs. Bird. Mr. Blur Bird flew off. Boo-hoo! I'll never see Mrs. Bird again. It was getting dark. Mr. Bird could not see where he was going. Crash! Mr. Bird bumped into something. It was his old house. That old, old house that Mrs. Bird hated. I'll go inside, he said. I'll rest there until the rain stops. Mr. Bird went in. And there was Mrs. Bird, sitting there singing. I love my house. I love my nest. In all the world, this nest is best. You here, gasped Mr. Bird. I thought you hated this old nest. Mrs. Bird smiled. I used to hate it, she said. But a mother bird can change her mind. You see, there's no nest like an old nest for a brand new bird. And when the egg popped open, the new bird thought so too. And that's the end of the story. Tweet, tweet, tweet. A bird flapping its wings. Come on, flap, flap, tweet, tweet. Up in the air I fly. Tweet, tweet, a tweet, tweet, tweet. High in the clear blue sky. Tweet, tweet, a tweet, 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 tweet. Tweet to tweet to tweet to tweet 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 to tweet to tweet tweet. Hmm, something else that flies. A rocket. Ready for the countdown? Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero, blast off! Up in the air I fly. Zoom, zoom, a zoom, a zoom, zoom. High in the clear blue sky. Zoom. Zoom, 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 and landing. More flying in an animation now. B. A butterfly. Bird. A worm. Little birds. A balloon. Helicopter. Aeroplane. And the little bird again. Fly like a bird. Come on, fly up high, fly, and fly down low. Whee! 
fly over here. Yeah. Oh, oh. <laughs> What's this? It's Benita with a message. Mm -hmm. So we've got a picture of a bird, an arrow, and a chair. Hmm. Mm. Well, a bird flies, so fly. Yeah. Uh, an arrow points to something, so fly to. Aha, that's the story chair. So fly to the story chair. Fly to the story chair. Where's the story chair? Past the toys, past bitten bot, and to the story chair. Fly, fly. Tweet, 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 tweet. Oh, yeah. Another <laughs> message. Let's read this one. Okay. Here's someone. Looks like they're jumping. And another arrow. So jump two. And what's this? Fish in a box. Aha. It's fish in a tank. So jump to the fish tank. <laughs> All right. Jump off to the story chair. Jump. And jump past the toys. Jump, jump, jump to Bit and Bot. Hello, Bit and Bot. Ah, any messages? Here, yeah, we've got one. Let's read it together. Right. Here are some eyes looking. An arrow. Look to now three shapes. An arch. A circle and a square. Aha! Look to the play school windows. They're the windows. Yes. So let's look through the round window. And there's Rebecca and Victoria. And they're well, one's writing a letter, Rebecca's writing a letter, and Victoria's doing a drawing. What's that? Snake. What is it? Snake. It's a snake, is it? Yeah. You draw me something. Come on. And there's Rebecca and Victoria's mother. I think she's helping them. Oh, she's just writing Victoria's name on her picture. Victoria. Is that your name? Daddy. Is that all of you writing your name, are you? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That. How about Rebecca writing? <laughs> he, he. Look. Ah. He's got feelings too. It's a letter. What are you drawing this time? Is that a snake again? Yeah. Look, snake. Love. From. Love. Rom. Have you finished? Mm. Put my sister Love from Rebecca. Can I have yours, Rebecca? Yes. Are you going to address the envelope? Yes. Can you address it for me. Uh, finishing off the envelope. You fold yours and I'll fold it to yours. Okay. Let's see if they fit in the envelope. Fold it again. We'll put them both in together. Okay. Yes, in they fit. Hmm. Lick the stick a bit. Stick it yeah, down. You put a stamp on it and post it. There's the stamp. Now it's ready to be posted. We'll go post the letter. And when Rebecca wants to move around, yeah. she goes in this special chair. Yeah. And now off to the post box. <laughs> Victoria's helping push too. driveway of their house. Down the street. An 
And there's the letterbox. Here's the postbox. Post it. And into the letterbox. Just getting Big Ted dressed. I think there's going to be a party. Ah, here's the postman. Special delivery for the toys. Invitations to a party. Oh, for great. For Big Ted. All right. Humpty and Jemima. All right, well, I'll read Big Ted's. <clears throat> OK, so, Big Ted, come to a hat party. Hey, fantastic, Big Ted. And Ready for a party? Humpty's one. I'll read Humpty's. Uh -huh. It's Humpty, come to a hat party. Great. Oh. All right, and... Jemima. All right, I'll read Jemima's. Jemima, come to a hat party. Fantastic. Mm. All right, need some hats. Uh, some hats here. Uh-huh. So, this one for Jemima. Put it on, Jemima. It's got a footfish mm. on the front. Very nice. All right, now, Big Ted, I've got the perfect thing for you. A... Letterbox hat. Mm -hmm. Pushing your ears. Oh, tuck them under. Where's your face, Ted? Ah, there we are. Oh, that's fantastic. Fantastic. Yes. And finally.